Hello, sir. Hello. My name is Mohammed. I'm one of the ED doctors. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, doctor. Can I confirm your name and date of birth, please? Yes. My name is Mustafa, uh, 1st of May, 1994. All right, Mustafa. How can I help you today? Actually, doctor, I had a cast for ankle sprain, and then uh, they removed it in the ER two days ago. But since then, I cannot walk, and I have some weakness in my leg. Oh, sorry to hear that. So um, um, I need to perform examination for the nerves which supply your legs. Is that OK with you? Yeah, it's OK. Um, are you comfortable at the moment? Yeah, I'm comfortable. Do you need some painkillers? No, thank you. All right. So we will need, um, could you please uh, remove your trouser and keep your underwear? Yeah, sure. And uh, we will need to do the examination then. Is that all right? Yes, OK. OK, I'm going to call one of the nurses to attend the chevron. OK. Fine? Okay. So I'm going to wash my hands and put gloves, um, and then we'll start. Okay. All right? OK. So, uh, Mr. Mustafa, would you mind if you can walk there and come back for me? Yes. All right. Okay. Thank you. You, you don't need to. Uh, I can see that you have a problem. There is a food drop on the right side. So, can I have a quick look while you are standing like this? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to check for any scars, fasciculation, involuntary movements, or muscle wasting. Thank you. Would you mind coming to the bed? Let okay. me help you. Yeah, and if you could lie down for me. Okay. <coughs> Fine. So I'm going to um, assess your legs now. So I will start by assessing the tone. <coughs> this is uh, rolling. OK, I'm going to lift your legs. And this is the lifting for assessment of the tone, normal tone. And now mm -hmm. I'm going to assess the power. So uh, Mr. Mustafa, would you mind pushing against my hand up? Hip flexor, hip flexor, and then down. Hip extensor, hip extensor, and can you push out? Hip abductors, hip adductors. Thank you. Can you bend your legs for me, please? Both of them. Thank you. Can you try to bend this more? Hip, uh, this is the knee flexor, knee flexor, and can you straighten it for me? Knee extensor and knee extensor. Thanks. Can you straighten them? And now, can you move your foot towards your face? Good, and the other one? OK, so there is weakness of the right ankle dorsiflexor. flexor. Can you move that one up? OK, the left one is uh, intact. And now can you push against me? OK, uh, plantar flex, uh, flexion is intact. And can you move your big toe towards your, uh, yourself? OK, this one? OK, can you push? Fine. So there is. Uh, Weakness in the right uh, dorsi flexor of the ankle. All right, so let's go and assess the reflexes. So I'm going to tap uh, in your uh, knee and ankle. So would you mind to relax your leg for me? Yeah. I'm going to tap in here. OK, can you cl clench your teeth? Good, thank you. That's L3, L4. L3, L4. Can you bend your leg for me? This one. Bend it and hang it there. And I will assess the ankle reflex. S1, S2. Thanks. And this one. Good. Thank you. And now I'm going to assess something called clonus. Any problem with your ankle? No? No. OK. Ankle clonus. Fantastic. And I'm going to scratch over your soul. This is a plantar response. It's uncomfortable a little bit, which is down going. Good. Down going. That's normal plantar response. Uh, and now I will assess the coordination. So could you bring your heel to the knee and move it down the shin and touch uh, my hand, please? OK, and repeat again. Heel, knee, shin test. Thank you. This one. That's fantastic. And now I'm going to assess the sensation over your legs. Fine? So I'm going to show you the feeling of this cotton wool here. Do you feel it? Yes. So could you close your eyes and say yes whenever you feel the touch? Yes. Yes. L2 intact? Yes. Yes. L3 intact? Yes. There is lots of sensation over L4 on the right side. 
That's actually L5, not L4? Yes. Yes. L4 is intact? Yes? Yes. Yes. S1 is intact? Yes. Yes. S2 is intact, and I would like to assess the, the sensation around the inner canal, S345. <coughs> Thank you very much. And now I would like to assess the pain sensation using the European, um, and I'm going to examine the proper reception. So I'm going to show you, uh, Mr. Mustafa. This is up and this is down. Okay. Close your eyes and tell me the direction. Down, down, up, up, down, up. That's normal. And now I will assess the vibration sense using the tuning fork. So I'm, I'm going to show you how it's buzzing and how it's stopped, okay? okay? And close your eyes and tell me when it's buzzing and when it's stopped. Buzzing, stop. All right. Buzzing, stop. Fantastic. Thank you. Uh, to complete my examination, I would like to examine the cranial nerves and the upper limb CNS examination. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Mustafa. I'm going to give you some time to dress um, up, okay? okay? Do you need any help for that? No, thank you. All right, and then we will speak again. Okay. Fine? Okay. Um, so actually, uh, what happened is, because of the cast, uh, it looks like it caused a compression on one of the nerves in your leg. It's called the combrinian nerve. Uh, and that cause weakness in your leg, so you can't uh, move your leg, your foot towards your body, all right? And also you have a uh, sort of uh, sensation loss as well. Mm. Uh, we call this neuropraxia, and this is the temporary paralysis. Mm. So this is the good news, it's temporary. It shouldn't be permanent. It might take days to weeks. Mm. What we need to do is to give you a painkillers, and also you need a physiotherapy, mm. all right? Um, and follow up with your GB. Okay? Okay. Uh, how is your home status? Who do you live with? I live with my wife. Okay. So yeah. do you think it's safe to go home? Yeah, yeah. Fine. And it doesn't need any imaging or anything, all okay. right? Okay. Um, as this is obviously just because of the compression. Okay. Do you have any question? No, thank you, doctor. Thank you very much. Welcome. <coughs>